everybody, I'm Rob the Ranger. This is the wildlife. Enjoy the video. First time I've seen these little cubs on a kill. Yeah. Uh, they have been on many kills, but I just haven't seen it before. No, they, they they start eating meat at about six weeks. It's just just me personally haven't seen them do it before. So the two different mothers. Two yeah, different the, the two little ones are from one female, and the bigger ones from the female with the end of a tail missing. Uh, they, the bigger one is theoretically already weaned, but uh, will still suckle because the other female is still producing milk for the littler cubs. It's a, a, a pig, wild pig. Small. The ones are getting in each other's way. But that's something they learn as they get older. Each line for itself when it comes to eating. So already a little a little that stage now they're gonna get feisty with one another. And big adult lions will actually do each other quite a bit of damage over the last scraps of, of a kill. And then obviously when the kill's finished they all make up and everything. Looks like a lot of the blood around the adult female's mouth there is her own. She seems to have a cut in the in the cheek there. Yeah. Oh, that's not from the animal. Yeah, it looks like she got maybe when the the when the two females, the two adult females were feeding, one got a claw in the other one. And the other little one already already fed, yes. So the it's a big fairly big pig to feed, you know, two adults and three It doesn't adults. look like a fairly big pig, to be honest. It's, it's not going to fill them full. I don't think that it's just a, like an impala or a snack. So look at, a looking at the size of the head, looks like it was a young warthog. The young lion uh, could eat for that one, the big one. Well, usually it goes by size. So yeah. the, the two females would eat, then Maybe one female in the bigger cup, and then the little cubs get a get a chance. Yeah, I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do that. 
geht das immer so quer. Und die Nein, meine Frau ist auch ziemlich stark. Und ich denke, das wird auch ein bisschen <laughs> Do they eat everything of the warthog? Yeah, they're, well, the, the skull will probably be left behind. The skull of a warthog is very, very hard, very solid. Okay. And there's not a lot of nutrition in it, so they'll, they'll leave the skull, but everything else. You see, the little ones are already feeding on the skin. Will anybody else eating the skull? No. Not even really hyenas go for warthog skulls. Die Kopflasse ist anscheinend liegen. Ja. Sie sehen nicht, was wollte ich sehen. Lots of marrow in the legs, so crushing the bones, they get all that nutrition from the marrow. <laughs> no, <laughs> to do all this by themselves. It's a bit so hungry, you should be careful, huh? <laughs> They probably know that they'd attack us to be the end of them, right? Yes. Yeah. They probably have a sixth sense of that. No problem. Have a guest get sick watching this? Yeah. Yeah. I can imagine. Can you hear the bones crunching? Mm. <laughs> Is it a bad cut on the mouth? No, uh, not really. Okay, just bleeding. <laughs> well, she she looked like she'd done it earlier. When we saw her the other day, she had quite a big black mark there, which was probably a scab. And what's probably happened is she's actually just had it knocked off fighting over the skill rather than opening a new wound. How old are 
These ones, the cubs, they're, they're about four months, these ones. And then six, six, six and a half months for the other bigger one at the back there. Is that little of one of a scar on his head? Or yeah. Just yeah, it's a scar. It's it got some kind of infection on its forehead and massive swelling, and then I think it got a smack. Do you know, is it a male or female? It's a male with a scar on the head and a female the other one. Yeah, <laughs> 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 So im Zimmer. Durch den Keller. Die Kellerbar. <lacht> Hinter die Kellerbar. Also eine Pinnwand oder so, okay, gut, aber in groß, über das Bett. Ich weiß nicht. Zimmer fett, okay. Das ist die Haut. Das ist die Haut, das ist die Haut. Von unten, also ja. Ist der Lutig noch? Ich hoffe, das Fahrtenschwein hatte kein Kabel jetzt. How many cups uh, will one in a head normally? Um, I've seen as many as five. So it's usually two or three. And the survival rate is about one out of four females survive and one out of six males survive to adulthood. Really? Yeah. What's the main reason for them dying? Uh, lack of food mostly. Yeah? Yeah. What, what is the most reason? Lack of food. Eins, eins aus sechs Männchen überlebt und eins aus vier Weizen. Okay, yeah. So Chad, are these two past the stage where they would die? Or they no, no, they're up until they're about a year old. Yeah. So chances are one of those two is not going to make it. Quite possibly. And then uh, from a year, then the main cause of death is uh, Injuries, uh, you know, they, they get in the way of the adults. New males come into the area and attack them, that sort of thing. So, all right, that's all for now. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Leave a comment down below. Buy a T-shirt. Ding the notification bell. All those YouTube things. See you next time. So here's a couple of links to more videos on my channel that you might want to check out. Also the social networks, you can follow me there for live updates, pictures, etc. from Safari.